Academy Ireland, we have the bantamweight title on the line. Take a cat, Mandu, taking on Darren O'Brien. Mandu is in the black, O'Brien is in the white. Peter Lavery in charge, and we are underway. Yeah, it's such a good looking belt as well now. One of the most sought after belts in mixed martial arts, to be fair. Tackett, he's the type of fighter that he'll punch you when he's standing on the other side of the cage. He's got that long limbs. Nice inside leg kick, but O'Brien trying to negate that reach by getting in the inside. Tiger trying to stay on the outside, uses, uh, uses range. And again, speaking to both fighters, as you alluded to, as you were looking here, as we were chatting as they were coming in, Tiger's background of fighting is pub fighting, as he says, and Darren O'Brien is just thrown shapes. Two, uh, two very interesting styles. Nice left hand right down the line and gets a nod of approval by Darren O'Brien as well from Taka. O'Brien trying to blitz. Taka uses footwork to get out of there. O'Brien's really trying to close that distance. Get in for uh, short shot chops. Looking to work the body, Darren O'Brien. Brian said he had a, this is probably one of the best camps, but then he, he stopped in that comment and said, actually, I'm always training, so I don't really do camps. Nice right hand by Tackett. Right hand. Beautiful timing and precision on it. I like Tackett's movement. Anytime he has his back against the cage, he's uh, always circling to the side, so he's always ending up in the middle of the cage. Brian stepping in with the knee, but Taka seen it coming. Trying to get comfortable in there, Taka with that right hand. He's starting to find a home. Shakes off that takedown easy. There's that piston right hand as well, again by Taka. It's almost like the shots O'Brien is throwing. He thinks he's in within range because he's getting hit by Taka. So when he throws his shots, he's expecting to land, but Taka's nowhere to be seen, and the left hand lands that time, again by Taka. He's just, just out of range with those shots. And this is what O'Brien wants to get it in here in close quarters, but shaking off again. When I'm due. All the shots Taka's thrown as well are long, straight shots. He's thrown no inside hooks, because he wants to keep that distance. He's thrown some different feints to see how O'Brien reacts to them. It's that, it's that range, always just outside. Beautiful distance management. O'Brien, some success in close, lands it. Nice leg kick, but excellent out and around by both men, but Saka will be going back to his corner, the, the happier of the two, I feel. Second round about to get underway here. Taka Mandu, Darren O'Brien. I think uh, Darren O'Brien has a, uh, may possibly have a broken hand. Uh, he, was, uh, he was talking about it uh, to his corner and uh, he hasn't seemed to be throwing the right hand. That could definitely play in factor here. And just as you say that there, James, of now there. The opportunity for the right hook was there. He didn't throw it. So as hard as it is fighting, Takamandu with four limbs, losing one of them weapons, yeah. certainly going to hinder you. I'd like to see how uh, Darren deals with this adversity now. Um, if I was him, I'd really try and uh, look for that takedown. 
Nice head move, my boy O'Brien. Again, you look at the Cage Warriors title here for the Academy Ireland, and Cage Warriors, of course, returning to Cork on the 9th of November of this year. So, again, these young amateurs putting on a show here tonight could potentially get on the undercard of that. I'm sure, James, you'll be looking to get on the card yourself. Uh, yeah, hopefully. I've been riddled with injuries, so uh, I'm going to see how fit I am. Just as you said, that tackle caught the kick and landed a beautiful right hand. Good defense by Taka, and he's really, you can see it, and that's what I love about watching young fighters, James. When I've called Taka's fights on a good few occasions, but each time he goes away and you see him again, there's just an upgraded version in everything they do, and that's the same for every fighter, and the same can be said for Darren O'Brien. Yeah, it's, it's a credit to uh, the clubs and the fighters themselves that each time they're going out, they're, uh, they're coming back a better fighter, they're watching their fights and seeing where they can improve. Taka landing some good knees up against the cage right in front of his corner. Chris Fields, Tom King. O'Brien, some success there. But I definitely think you're right with that hand. He's not throwing the right hand at all. Yeah, he, 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 uh, he's throwing the right hand, but he's, he's not putting any venom into it with like yeah. the left hand. So Beautiful right hand there, boy. Taka. And Mantu is chasing him down, landing big shots. O'Brien is on wobbly legs. Smiles to his corner to say he's okay. Mandu looking to separate and throw strikes again. Yeah, Tiger got a bit too excited. He crowded his work there a bit. He's on the back of O'Brien. Some good shovel up our cuts up against the cage here. Perhaps the inexperience, as you said, James, rushed a little, but in on a big takedown and gets it. Yeah, if I, if I was uh, Tiger's corner, I'd be calling for him to disengage and stand the fight back up. I feel like uh, Darren's on wobbly legs here. End of the round coming up, and O'Brien is just holding on to a Kamara on the opposite side. Third and final round here of the Bantamweight title fight at Cage Warriors Academy Ireland. Takaman too, a huge second round. Almost had O'Brien out there, but fighter's heart, fighter's mind. Darren O'Brien still in there. Yeah, fair play to Darren O'Brien. He's. Uh, He's dealt with a bit of adversity in this fight, nearly getting finished on that uh, uh, broken right hand. Had a bit of success there. I'm not too sure if it was just the way Taka moved back, but he almost looked like he wobbled him a slight bit. He's really trying to put the pace on Taka here and put pressure on him. Wild left hand by Taka. He needs to go back to the technique that he was thrown earlier. Yeah, Brian did well there. He's using head movement to uh, break the distance and then uh, uh, possibly set up that big left hook. Darren, Darren using that uh, on the hook, trying to turn him back onto the cage. Looking for the trip there, Takamandu wasn't there. O'Brien, good work. I'd say this is the most successful spell of the bout so far for Darren O'Brien. Look to beat that leg and get a trip. Almost used it. Body gripped it. Try and pick up Taka. Beautiful knee by Taka on the separation there. And Brian is trying to use that head movement to close and get the distance. And Taka has been quite reserved in this round and not as much output thrown. Maybe he's sitting back and looking to select his shots. Nice stiff jab on the back foot and O'Brien putting the pressure on. He gets caught though, O'Brien! Short hand and Peter Lavery almost looked like he stopped it. I think it's just a gum shield. He's, he has waved it off. A bit of a weird stoppage there. Peter Lavery ended up waving it off. He stepped in during the big shot by Takaman Dew, and Chris Fields was celebrating in the corner. Bit of a weird outcome there, but Takaman Dew has got it done, and we have a new 
Cage Warriors Academy RM Bantamweight Champion. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our referee is up here.